We'll guide you through how to use NVIDIA GeForce Experience Instant Replay to record gameplay. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This is super useful because if something really cool happens in a game, you can go back and capture it. So to go and do this, all you need to do is go and press Alt and Z on your keyboard to go and open up the GeForce Experience pop-up. Now what you want to do is go and locate Instant Replay and go and click on it. You want to go down and click on settings. So first of all, you can go and choose the amount of time which will be captured. So at the moment it's set to five minutes. You can make it shorter or longer. For me, I'll just do one minute, but you may want to make it longer. You can then go and choose the quality. Of course, ultimately that will be up to you. The higher the quality, the higher the file size. I think medium is quite a good uh, option to go for. Resolution, that's up to you. I'll just use the in-game resolution. The frame rate is a smoothness. So I think 60 FPS is a good option. And the bit rate is the quality. I'm not gonna change that there. We can then go and click on save. Now you wanna head over to the right and go and click on the gear or cog icon to open the settings. You wanna come into recordings and you just wanna to go to videos here and just make sure it's somewhere you can easily find it. So that's fine with me. Then you wanna go and scroll down and you want to go and find keyboard shortcuts. You shouldn't need to scroll down actually. Now here you want to go and scroll down and TC record. And here you'll go and see the option for saving the last minutes recorded. Mine says one, as that's why I said it as, but yours will be different. So you can go and choose the shortcut here. At the moment it's Alt F10, so you can just familiarize yourself with that. That's fine, so I'm gonna keep it as Alt F10. And I'll press back. We can press done. And then what you need to do is go and turn on instant replay. So select it, click on turn on. You can see the shortcut there, but I'll just do it manually. So now it's turned on. So now you can go and get into a game and I'll give you a quick example. So let's went and say something just insane happened and all you need to do is go and press the shortcut. For me, it was Alt F10. And as you can see, we get this pop-up saying it saved the last one minute. So now we can go to the recording path and go and find it. I'm now in my videos folder and it's went and made a folder called Minecraft. So here it is, we can open it up and this is the instant replay here. As you can see, it's one minute long. If you found this guide useful, then leave a like.